Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going over Q1 of the recent uh, Lead Code Contest 222, Maximum Units on a Truck. So this one, to be honest, for me, it just took a little bit of reading. I The, the units and boxes, I don't know why they don't just put, like, um, I don't know, money or something like that here so that we can, it's clear what you're optimizing for because, um, at least for me, uh, by, by scanning, I, I for some reason, I because unit is also... Um, you know, you could say that that unit takes up room and stuff like that. So I just forgot which way it is. But even that said, um, like it's very greedy. Uh, you do it one at a time. Like, so basically each box is worth some value. Uh, that is the second one. And and because all boxes have the same size, if you want to call it that, um, it's just greedy because you always want to take the box with the most worth. Um, so you sort by that and then just take it one at a time or as many as a time. Um, you could do it one at a time. I think that may be fast enough given that technically that's a million loop, uh, but eh, that's probably unnecessary and you may get a TLE. I don't know how tough the test cases are for this case. Um, at least in Python, it may be on the edge of too slow. Um, maybe in other languages, it doesn't matter though. So yeah, so anyways, all I did is sort. Um, I sort by the negative so that I get the maximum value um, on the second, on the on the value um, first, so we maximize the value. I just put in a deck so that it's a little bit easier to uh, keep track of. Though, if you watch me during the contest, that's where I actually made a uh, mistake uh, and, and left this out and, and whoops. I don't know. I'm just careless today. Um, but yeah, but other than that, you know, for each box, now that we ha we sort it in a greedy way, we look at the units, which is the worth. Uh, we uh, we take the truck size and then and how many of those items that we have. And and then we just put it on the truck. It takes up current number of rooms and the value we added by the units times current. Um, that's all I have for this problem. Uh, it's It should be clear that this is linear time because, oh, sorry. Uh, the sorting is n log n, so it should be clear that it's n log n, but after that, it should be clear that this is linear time because we pop each uh, box, you know, at most once and process it once, so it's going to be linear in terms of space because we do sorting and then turn it into a cube, but either one of these is going to be O of n. So, yeah, uh, let me know what you think, and you can watch me solve it live and make silly mistakes all day next. It's way uh, confusingly written. slower than I would like, but just want to make sure it's right. Oh man, I knew that that was the case, but I forgot. <coughs> Silly mistakes.
Uh, silly mistake already. I was thinking. Hey everybody, uh, yeah. Happy New Year, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think about this poem. I had a rough contest, but sometimes it happens. Uh, so, you know, uh, don't feel so bad if it ha you know, happens to you either. Um, but I, for me, need to be more consistent. Let me know what you think about this poem and whatever. Uh, I will see you later. Bye-bye.